it's been a while since I uploaded um, but as you guys know oh my goodness what's with the loud hand gestures um, yeah as you guys know like I have so much assignments and like placement and work and stuff going on at the moment so my uploading won't be as frequent as um, it used to be but like, I've explained all of that already um, I just wanted to make a quick video to check back in with you guys just something quick to answer a few questions that I've been getting um, I've been getting emails from some of you guys and a lot of the time you guys are asking like how to stay motivated with fitness and eating healthy and um, yeah just mostly like how to stay motivated and feeling confident in the gym um, so I just quickly wanted to touch on that topic because um, I was at the gym earlier today like I'm still in my you know gym wear and I like I had a great workout but it wasn't perfect like I don't really know what some people think like your workout is supposed to be like because I feel maybe we might you know watch all these fitness gurus on YouTube or see all these people on Instagram who just look so strong and perfect and you know they're just hidden they're just on point with everything and they look amazing but the thing is like you don't see you're only seeing you know a few minutes or a few seconds even of their workout or of their day and you don't see everything else that happens behind the camera so like anyway with my workout today you know it was great but I failed a lot now like what what's failing like in my opinion the only way you can fail in the gym is by not going and by not challenging yourself and making yourself actually put in the work because as long as you're there and you're working and you have a goal that you're trying to get to like I don't see how it's possible to fail in the gym and you know I have some girls say to me that you know they just don't know what they're doing in the gym and they're embarrassed you know because of maybe their size or just you know like a bunch of it's insecurities really and I understand completely because I used to feel like that but now I honestly just don't give two facts. Like I, I, I literally don't care. I'm in the gym trying to work towards my goal. And if I'm doing pull-ups and I can only do one and a half, I can do one and a half pull-ups. Like that's an achievement for me. If you can do 20, that's great for you, but we're not the same. And like, you shouldn't really be comparing yourself to other people. Um. So yeah, I mean, I just wanted to tell you guys, like there is, being motivated and you know being confident and stuff like that but like you also have to understand that it's not really a competition I mean unless you're on stage at a fitness competition that's different but it's all you know an individual journey which you just need to be comfortable with yourself and what you're doing and if you're doing your best then you're doing your best like no one's gonna laugh at you in the gym I mean I have my friends well not my friends but like a few friends saying that oh they'd be embarrassed to you know not be able to do certain things in the gym and I'm just like yeah but nobody thinks like people in the gym don't actually think that way um well not in my gym anyway or you know the gyms that I've been to when you're there and you know you can ask someone for a spot and they will happily help you you know achieve the goal that you're trying to get to so it's really just not that kind of a community you know the fitness community I feel like especially on social media the fitness community is very supportive and very um, like understanding of how hard it is to you know get to certain milestones and be able to achieve certain things and you know do different workouts and tricks and you know whatever you want to call it um, like just today I was trying something new I was doing push-ups on a BOSU ball and like I can do you know a good few push-ups in a row normally but on the BOSU ball obviously it was much harder so I was just pushing myself to see how much I could do and I think I only lasted up until like 9 or 10 or something and yeah I just I couldn't go anymore and even after that I was still trying okay let me you know put my feet on the BOSU ball instead of having my hands on it tried with that after like I don't know five or something I completely fell flat on my face but like I didn't care if there was people watching because in my head I'm like I'm doing what I'm doing and that's my limit why are you watching me
like focus on your own workout you know it's not really about comparing yourself to other people and stuff like that so I don't want to go on any you know I don't want to start rambling and stuff like that I wanted this video to be just very very quick because I am on night duty next week today is Sunday and um, I want to quickly try and edit this and get it up for you guys and then I need to sleep <laughs> wake up you know and stay up really late and then sleep again so I can be ready for my night duty and yeah that's just a quick update from me you guys and make sure to follow me on Instagram because I won't be uploading onto YouTube like every week but I will be posting daily on Instagram I post my food I post you know my workout sometimes like if I'm at the gym I might take a selfie show my body progress or just post a video of something new that I'm doing or whatever um so yeah follow me on Instagram I'll link it in the description box and as always if you guys have any questions if you need anything just email me I'll be happy to help email will be in the description box also my twitter and my facebook all that jazz um yeah so i hope you guys find this little pep talk i guess you can call it helpful and make sure to thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're not subscribed already you know the whole trail and i'll see you next time bye guys and ab wise i'm i don't know my abs are okay Still, you know, a load of fat, back fat, all of that going on because I mean, I am bulking.